mean, it, the truth is what he's doing is he's campaigning. I mean, that's really what he, he's, he's shoring up, making sure all the little liberals come out and all their hybrid cars and uh, wearing their sandals and their motel shower curtain. And that's what he's really doing. He's rallying them. So Ember Reichcott here gives, uh, <laughs> gives her take on what the president is up to with this trip he just took a couple weeks ago. Listen to her analysis. What's this? Absolutely. I honestly think that this president needed to recharge his batteries. It's been tough slogging out in Washington, and he really did need to get out among, among the people. Many of us, at least on the Democratic side, believe he has not gotten out enough and not used his bully pulpit enough to help to, to educate the American people on what is happening. And I think that's part of what was going on here. I do think he needs to lead, and he's listening so that he can now lead going into the fall. He needed to recharge his batteries. He needs to lead. He, he's listening. No, he's not. He's not listening whatsoever. The public wants less spending. They want less government. We don't want another public works program. He's not listening at all. What are you talking about recharge his batteries? Does he have to go to Martha's Vineyard to do that? Can he go to uh, maybe go uh, bunk with Bush down in Crawford? He's not recharging his batteries. He's taking a trip. And the president needs to lead. What's this president led on yet? He isn't leading. That's the whole point. I mean, how do you come up with that? As I mean, Amber Reichgott is just in la-la land. How do you come up with, with that analysis right there? He's, he's trying to go out. He, you know what he's doing here? He's saying, I care. It's the George Bush senior. I care. <laughs> So Matt Intenza then jumps in. This is later in the show. And he was asked by the host. Now, Tom Hauser wasn't hosting here. I can't remember the dude's name. It doesn't matter. Who cares? Asking if this was a policy trip or a political trip. Here's Matt Intenza's answer. Well, let's face it. It's both. Uh, George Bush uh, flew on an aircraft carrier and declared mission accomplished uh, because he wanted to make a statement about what he was doing. Uh, but this is an important opportunity for the president uh, to make sure the country knows his priority to create jobs and to get the economy going. And you can't just do that sitting in a bunker at the White House. <laughs> it was both. Well, Mr. Intenza, can you tell me what the new policy was? If it was partly policy, there must be a new one. I don't, I don't remember hearing one. And, of course, he's got to say, well, Bush did the same thing. Yeah, the evil Bush did, did typical Democrat. That's their first and only. You know, when the Democrats pick on George Bush or when they do the, the play class warfare or the race card, it's a good indicator that they have no argument. Because that's what they do when they get desperate. Ah, you're just a racist. You're just tax cuts for the wealthy. It's, it's literally page one, two, and three of the Democrat playbook ever since the days of FDR. That's what they do. 